Whether you're an experienced runner or a novice, the most important part of your kit is your running shoes. A good quality pair will reduce the likelihood of injury and help you run faster for longer period. It is hard to find out a good pair of running shoes. So, some top running shoes have been shown in this video that will be help you the running shoes that you like most. So, if you really want you know which running shoes will give you ultimate satisfaction, watch the video up to the last. If you want to know the price of any shoe or to get any other information, please check the link given in the description. You'll get special discount if you use the link. And if you are new in our channel, then don't miss to hit the subscriber button. Let's get the video. Number 10. Nike Sock Dart SE. The Nike Sock Dart is a unique shoe in that it still looks futuristic, even this long after its inception. Moreover, the shoe is generally unisex and semi-wide footer friendly so it's for everyone. The thick and rubber outsole gives you the maximum amount of both durability and grip. The outsole also has vertical and horizontal flax grooves, which help support your foot's natural movement. Cushioning is very comfortable and also very lightweight. Not only does it comfort, it is also quite responsive. The Nike Sock Darts Upper is made of knitted textile, and provides great breathability through the material as well a lightweight from cushioning that adds extra comfort. The upper is also very flexible. To get more information about this the Nike Sock Dart SE, please check the link given in the description. And you'll get special discount if you use the link. Number 9. Nike Air Hirac Ultra. The Nike Air Hirac is one of the best options for you lightweight and damp. Breathability are the main highlights for this shoe and with huge selection of colorways you will definitely find a pair suitable for your personal taste. The saddle is executed in molded detail as a nod to the original design and uses next generation flywire cord to keep the midfoot locked down and the fit component intact. Majority of wearers like the upper's neoprene mesh material. If you're going to use them for running, don't worry they will provide you with enough support to feel secure comfortable and stable all the time. The main support comes from the synthetic leather cage which is connected with lacing system, so when you lace them up tightly, the leather cage hugs your foot nicely and secure to preserve from any unneeded foot movements. You can't really feel this air unit in the back area because of thick foam layer around it. Although, it definitely adds a huge amount of bounce and makes noticeable differences between the forefoot and heel area. Many users love that the shoe has a snug fit because it makes the experience of wearing them extremely comfortable. To get more information about this Nike Air Air Hirac Ultra, please check the link given in the description. And you'll get 50% discount if you use the link. Number 8. Nike Run Swift. These men's Nike Run Swift shoes blend highly breathable mesh and tightly woven mesh in the midfoot for support. Integrated flywire cables provide midfoot lockdown, while Cushlon foam delivers a responsive ride. This model is a step above the downshifter and a step below the windflow, and definitely feels like it. It's not as soft or breathable as the windflow, but leagues better than the downshifter. Surprisingly, despite the single pieces of outsole that run the length of the shoe, it's actually more flexible than the segmented downshifter. It's also a little softer than that model, with a little more bounce in the heel, especially. The forefoot cushion isn't really that good, though. It felt relatively dead. If you're looking for arch support, this shoe isn't it. The medial side is nearly as flat as the toe area. However, there is some stability, on account of the uninterrupted medial outsole piece. To get more information about this Nike Run Swift, Please check the link given in the description. And you'll get special discount if you use the link. Number 7. Nike Air Zoom Pegasus 34. The Nike Pegasus is one of the longest continuing running shoe series in the history of the footwear industry. The 34 suffix to the shoe name is a testimony to how long the Pegasus has been around. It won't be far-fetched to say that the Pegasus is nearly as old as Nike itself. The midsole and outsole largely stayed the same on the 34s. You still have the same 10mm drop and the little air bubbles that sit under the heel and forefoot. 
so you can expect the same great bounce back and responsiveness that you are used to with the Pegasus line. The upper of the Nike Air Zoom Pegasus 34 is highly flexible, with the only structure found within its heel. Seamless but for one seam just behind the heel, it's made of solid Flemish material, which securely wraps around foot after lace-up to provide a sock-like fit. You should be able to extract more than 400 miles with the Pegasus. Wear and tear will happen with the foam midsole and insole, though the Zoom Air bags will retain their cushioning as long as they do not accidentally deflate. To get more information about this Nike Air Zoom Pegasus 34, please check the link given in the description. And you'll get special discount if you use the link. Number 6. Nike Air Vapor Max Flucknet. Many purchasers love the design of the Nike Air Vapor Max Flucknet's upper unit, stating that it looked cool. The different colorways that are available for this shoe received positive feedback. This shoe felt suitably lightweight for daily use, noted a number of runners. Most of those who have tried this shoe wrote that the midsole was comfortable enough to carry their feet responsibly throughout various activities. There were individuals who were able to use this shoe for gym exercises and other sports and they felt that it was efficient. The cushioning setup works in a way that the air pockets are strategically placed on the sole at pressure points. Gaps between the pockets allow for proper landing and takeoff, and for runners concerned with heel support if they're heel strikers, the thickest pocket of air is located at the back. There were comments about the Vapor Max Flucknet's underfoot feel, which was apparently as soft as running on clouds. To get more information about Nike Air Vapor Max Flucknet, please check the link given in the description. And you'll get special discount if you use the link. Number 5 Nike Air Max 97 OG This model is designed by Christian Tresser and inspired by Japan's high-speed bullet trains. Reviewers consider this Nike Air Max 97 slightly wider than its earlier versions, and said it puts a lot of comfort to the feet particularly in the forefoot. The wide width sizing and fit of this sneaker gives comfort to feet, especially when it gets puffed up towards the latter part of the day and it favors those who have wide foot. The upper of this Air Max 97 edition is soft and flexible. The reduced volume of air in the midsole did not bother those who tried this shoe and said it even feels softer to the feet. It is comfortable shoe to walk around with the Nike Air bladder feature in the sole. The synthetic upper blocks dirt and water from easily getting into the shoe. Buyers are happy that retailers are offering this updated sneaker in marked down prices. To get more information about Nike Air Max 97 shoes, please check the link given in the description. And you'll get special discount if you use the link. Number 4. Nike Epic React Flucknet. The Nike Epic React Flucknet men's running shoe provides crazy comfort that lasts as long as you can run. Its Nike React foam cushioning is responsive yet lightweight, durable yet soft. This attraction of opposites creates a sensation that not only enhances the feeling of moving forward, but makes running feel fun too. Nike React feels incredibly bouncy. As your foot lands, the foam responds to the impact of your step by snapping back. The more energy you put into your step, the more energy you get in return. Compared to the similarly soft Nike Lunarlin cushioning, you get 13% more energy return with React. Flucknet material conforms to the shape of your foot, creating a snug, hug-like feel. With the booty-style construction, the tongue is seamlessly part of the upper. This eliminates the pressure a traditional tongue puts on the top of your foot. Combined with the bouncy soft feeling of React underfoot, it's like you're wearing slippers on a mattress. The foam outsole shows the hard work and wear of many miles, yet it resists compression and keeps its shape. Based on testing with champion runners like Galen Rupp, the shoe's cushioning still feels like new after roughly 300 miles. To keep the shoe as light as possible, traction is placed only where critical. Based on data, rubber sections on the toe and heel help you grip the ground and push off. To get more information about this Nike Epic React Flucknet, please check the link given in the description. And you'll get 49% discount if you use the link. Number 3. Nike Air Max Tavas. 
the men's Nike Air Max Tavas leather running shoe is a classic in the making. Killer style, premium materials and a contemporary meets old school design all add up to a timeless sneaker you'll want to rock all season long. The Nike Air Max Tavas can be very comfortable in certain areas of the foot. The heel and forefoot, for instance, are very amply padded giving you a soft responsiveness that's just a dream to run in. The uppers are seamless even on the inside, so there aren't any stray threads or stitches that could dig into your skin and cause blisters. The shoes also use a highly flexible rubber sole that bends and moves in coordination with your step. This helps make running and walking feel extra natural so you don't have to exert extra energy just to get your feet moving against the resistance of a stubborn sole. The upper and sole construction is seamless and strong, giving you a hard-wearing silhouette that's both responsive to movements and resistant to too much bending. The materials are also top-notch, staying pretty much the same even after months of use. To get more information about this Nike Air Max Tavis, please check the link given in the description. And you'll get special discount if you use the link. Number 2. Nike Air Presto. The Nike Air Presto Essential Men's Shoe delivers the same unrivaled fit and comfort that marked the 2000 debut of the original. The outsole of the Air Presto is designed from a thin layer of hardened rubber. The thin cut of the plastic does very little to add weight to the design of the shoe. Air Presto also gives the shoe a decent level of traction gaining capabilities. The midsole of the Air Presto is cut from a single layer of EVA form. The EVA form in the midsole of the shoe features the classic Nike swoosh in a rather contrasting color which aids in the aesthetic of the overall shoe. The upper of the Air Presto is designed to provide maximum comfort to the wearer's feet. The shoe does have a few plastic coverings on the upper, but they do very little to add any weight to the shoe either. The Air Presto is one of the most comfortable shoes. This is because of the shoe's use of plush, lightweight material in the design. Air Presto has a minimalist upper design from cushioned mesh. The mesh in the upper of the shoe allows the shoe to conform to the shape of wearer's feet rather easily. Overall the Air Presto is an amazing shoe that could just use a few minor adjustments. It is extremely comfortable and provides a decent amount of support for the heel and arches of the wearer's feet. To get more information about this Nike Air Presto, please check the link given in the description. Number 1 Nike Air Zoom Mariah Flocknet Racer The Nike Air Zoom Mariah is in all honesty, a beautiful shoe. It is a lightweight racing shoe that comes in as many colorways as you can imagine. The throwback runner was designed to act and feel like a sock without compromising the support many runners crave. The Mariah Racer features an outsole with a web tread at the forefoot for traction. If you take a look at the underside of the shoe, You'll also notice a significant cutout area that leaves the midsole exposed. The outsole on these shoes is created from a hardened plastic material, a material that is seen on a variety of Nike shoes. The layer of plastic that makes the outsole is relatively thin, which isn't necessarily a bad thing because it is a huge contributor to lightweight feeling of the shoe overall. The upper of Nike's racer features fly knit which is a lightweight fabric that allows the feet to breathe. The seamless nature of the upper helps to keep blisters at bay and makes the shoe really feel like a sock, just like Nike intended. There are several factors about this shoe that aid it in its efforts of giving the user maximum comfort. Overall, the Mariah is a great shoe to have. The stylish overall design of the shoe, coupled with the comfort that it gives is a huge bonus for the wearers of this shoe. To get more information about this Nike Air Zoom Mariah Flocknet Racer, Please check the link given in the description. And you'll get special discount if you use the link. Thanks for watching. Subscribe our channel for more videos.